setting up an Alpha Wi-Fi Camp Pro 2 on an Android cell phone. The first thing we want to do is go into our settings and connect the Android's Wi-Fi to the Wi-Fi Camp Pro network. What you see on your screen may vary depending on what version of Android you have. If your Wi-Fi is off, go ahead and turn it on. It'll scan and find a network called Wi-Fi Camp Pro 2. Go ahead and join this network. You may get a pop-up like this telling you the internet's not available. That's okay. If you do, we want to keep the Wi-Fi connection because we still need to set up the Wi-Fi Camp Pro. Once it shows you're connected to the Wi-Fi Camp Pro network, we're going to go out of the settings and open a web browser on your screen. Now you won't be able to load any websites yet, so you may get a screen like this. That's okay. What we're going to do is go to the setup IP address of the Camp Pro, which is 192.168.36.1. And this should take us to the Alpha Setup screen, just like this. It's asking us to please set up the password to access the setup in the future. In my case, because I've done this before, I have a stored password, but what you're going to see is a blank area. So we're going to go ahead and type in a password. It's going to ask us to repeat the password in a second box. We'll click Submit, and this will get us inside the Wi-Fi Camp Pro 2. We should see a scanning message on the screen, and then it should show all of the networks around. Now, I'm currently not in a campground location. I'm in a corporate environment, and my Camp Pro is inside my building. Yours should be outside, so you should be seeing some more networks with stronger signals. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and connect to our office network, which is Rockland Aris, by tapping on it and then tapping on the select button. It now fills in the hotspot name for me, and I have a field here called hotspot password. This is where I need to type in the password for my office network, or in your case, the campground network. Once we've typed the password in, we're going to scroll down to the very bottom into this field called Network Password, and we're going to type in another password. This is the password that we're going to use to secure our Wi-Fi Camp Pro signal, so anybody else that wants to join this network will need to know this network password. Now this can be the same as the password to the network you're extending if you want it to be. It can also be the same as the administrator password if you want it to be. Or it can be something different, but it does need to be at least eight characters long. If you're not sure that you typed it correctly, we recommend backspacing and typing again. And then we're going to type the finish, tap the finish button. Now, this is where it gets interesting. We have a notice on the screen here. It says, verify wireless authentication, set up wireless and check connectivity. Please reconnect Wi-Fi and select the Wi-Fi Camp Pro 2 network. What this means is when the setup process is finishing and changes are being applied, your phone may not reconnect to the Wi-Fi Camp Pro network automatically because it now has a password where it was open when we first connected to it. So you're going to see this screen on your phone indefinitely unless you reconnect to the Wi-Fi Camp Pro network, which is what we're going to do, just like it tells us. We're going to go back to the main screen and we're going to go into our settings and we're going to go into our Wi-Fi and see my Wi-Fi is reconnected back to my company network. So I'm going to go back in here, let it scan. And it looks like it hasn't finished uh, setting back up yet. It hasn't finished its reboot, so the network's not quite reappearing. Here it is. So we'll go ahead and tap on it. It's now a secured network, and it's asking me for the password. So I'm going to go ahead and type in the password I created for it. And click Connect. 
and I'm now connected and I no longer have the error that there's no internet access so I should be all set to go to verify I'll go ahead and open up my browser it's still going to be showing applying changes on this screen because this screen basically hangs and tells you to reconnect so we'll go ahead and uh, refresh here And we'll just try going to a website. Let's check on the weather. And up comes the weather site. So we're now connected to the internet through the Wi-Fi Camp Pro 2. If I want to go back in and check on any of my settings, I just go back to the 192.168.36.1 page. And it gives me all the status information, including the signal strength. So we're good to go.